extracting valleys in the Burundian coast. Also, there is a natural port here in Lima, and that, that one became the most important for about uh, 300 years. So from here to the left, look, beautiful buildings, boulevard, monuments. So this was this place, Salud Salud. This part of the city was the capital in the colonial times, and that's when South America was one country. Before, South America was a country. No Argentina, Chile, Bolivia, no. It was Peru, and the capital was Lima. Yeah, South America. It's the Italian Art Museum. Italians, they always came since the colonial times because they were captains, they were business people, artists, architects. And on the right, after Lima, the second largest city is Arequipa. Arequipa is located also at the Andes, and the population there is about one million people. So there is a big contrast between Lima. Okay, we are getting off here and we will spend in this square only 10 minutes, 10 Peruvian minutes. <laughs> Otherwise, the police might think we will be next group and we will start the demonstration. <laughs> right, so this was the first touristy area of Lima. Miraflores is the second, but now it's modern, upscale. Now this area, there is some activity during the daytime. At night, everything is closed. Yeah. This is the Unjustice Palace. Oh, I'm sorry. Justice Palace. <laughs> Revolution? I'm sorry. Justice Palace. <laughs> the Justice Palace is the Supreme Court House. Supreme Court is part of the Minister of Justice. In the back, there is an Airbnb room inside the palace. Oh. Alright, please let's go to the middle of the square. Here, we always have to watch out for the cars. In Lima, hello, these pedestrians will have the right of way. But in theory, cars, they have the right of way. Yes, I'm sorry. So that's why we don't go to the gym. There's no need for Peruvians to go to the gym. Every time we have to cross the street, we run. Yes, we are always running. These are not government offices. No, these are uh, apartments, private offices, or bars, theaters, social clubs. There is a hotel. Oh my gosh, Mark, you, you almost tripped. <laughs> Yeah. Why, you want to be in my video? <laughs> Hello. It's your safety. So I always do the pants. Oh, now I can see his face. Good enough. Oh, that was good. No, I saw his. Uh, that's why I had you guys on the corner because you can see his face. Okay. It's birds. Mark's taking yeah, pictures. Pretty clean. Yeah. Like oh, the like police are right there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. On the way from the airport. Yeah. What? Yeah. I'm happy. Oh yeah. I think his name just like keep it moving. It's just no. It's just like yo. I'm over here. Like, I'm assuming like the the liability. Yeah. Oh okay. They're going back. Yeah. We always ask. They're really protecting that statue, huh? Yeah. No, they just don't want. Uh, 
Oh, it's like the um startup of protest. Oh, okay. This is the instigation point. Like oh, everybody the, comes here to start a protest. So they're here to like, all right, motherfuckers, oh, don't break our shit. There. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Turn up the volume. Yeah. You turn up the volume. Yeah, your volume doesn't work. Uh I'm gonna get pooped on.
feeding them, Ben. <laughs> I would like a Lima <laughs> I am doing what somebody has done a hundred years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Make that 200 years ago. It feels very old. Give it some, give it some fat pigeon. <laughs> Turkey vultures. Corner of the yellow building. Okay. What time? At 10 40. Okay, in about 20 minutes. I will see you there in 40. I will see you all the morning in the day. Do you want to play some feature? Yeah. I know. Look, oh, look at that dog. He's not actually lazing around. He's actually. He's about to go pee. You can tell. Ready to attack. Oh, what a life. <laughs> Oh, Christine wants to really take pictures in that letters. <laughs> <laughs> 